Hi Libra, hope you all are doing well. This is your weekly reading, messages of light and love. Come forward here for Libra spirit. What do they need to know for their highest good and for the highest good of all? The most likes and views on my videos each week, the top three videos get a bonus reading. So if you wanna see your bonus reading, please hit the like button for me if this video is resonating with you. Let's see what's going on here with you, Libra. We have the Five of Cups. We have the Seven of Swords. The Lover's card. Wow. Bottom of the deck, we have a Three of Pentacles, the Hermit card, Ten of Swords, Six of Wands, and the Seven of Cups. You're dealing with someone here who may have been exploring other options. This person I'm picking up already that they don't want to work on themselves to heal the relationship. It's easier for them to try and look for someone else. But... <laughs> As luck would have it for them, there is no luck in relation to that. They know that they can't find anything better than you here, Libra. This has been a hard, hard pill to swallow here, Libra, because this person was dishonest with you. Seven of Swords is in the current energy. You may have be finding out or suspecting that this person you're dealing with here has been unfaithful or dishonest in some way. Let's get some clarity here. Why is this Five of Cups here? We have the Temperance card, Sagittarius energy. I feel like a lot of you here, Libra, are being patient, waiting to deal with this situation. The Star card is here, really hoping that things aren't the way that you found them. We have the Moon card, hoping this person wasn't hiding from you here. Because there is a lot of love in this relationship, a lot of passion, a lot of connection. This is a soulmate energy. Why is the Seven of Swords here? We have a Five of Wands. I feel like this person couldn't help themselves. Three of Cups. They may have been hanging out with a friend of theirs, maybe even drinking. They have a lack of judgment when it comes to whoever these people they were hanging out with. You, you may have been feeling that you were competing with someone else in this situation. That your person was talking to other people, suspecting that they were exploring their other options. The Hermit card is here. So I am picking up here that um, a lot of you here have a problem with trusting your person. I feel like... this. Okay, don't take this the wrong way. Wrong way, Libra, and take it how it resonates for you because the energy sometimes flip flop and reverse. But your person may have been hanging out with other friends, they could be flirting with friends or just hanging out with friends in a completely platonic way. Um, this person may have left you out of this this gathering of friends, and so it left you wondering what, what this person was up to. So they may have been setting the stage to have some kind of relationship with someone who started out being just a friend. As you suspected that they were perhaps cheating or being dishonest or unfaithful to you, they kind of took that as an open window of, well, if, if Libra thinks I'm cheating, but I'm not, then I guess I might as well go ahead and explore my options. This person is immature, okay? Um, they were not being truthful with you. They may have been grooming someone here to have this third party connection ahead of time. But the universe was trying to get you to be on your own here with the Hermit card. You may have been spending a lot of time alone here in the recent past. There's a lot of reliance on this person for your happiness as well because I feel like you expected more from this relationship as well. This person set up the stage to have you expect more from them. 
but I feel like this person was easily persuaded to be dishonest because there is betrayal in this connection, Ten of Swords. So you may have needed to spend time alone. Not that this meant to happen to hurt you, but um, I do feel like there was a lot of reliance on this person that you were with to maintain some level of happiness here, sort of like a codependent connection. And this relationship is meant to have you stand on your own two feet, not relying on other people to make you happy. However, this relationship is also teaching this person that they can't just go out and be dishonest and untruthful and just take whatever they want without being honest with you. Because I do feel like this person, um, they may have had multiple relationships in, your pa in their past where they were lying about what they were up to. And this relationship is teaching them some kind of a lesson. I feel like this person has always looked for the grass being greener on the other side. They're not going to find anyone better than you in terms of having a soul connection with. That's where this person was sorely mistaken that they damaged a relationship. They damaged the trust in this connection without really thinking things through. They lack judgment in their decision making serious lack of judgment and this person was trying to hide from you it's hard to once once the trust has been broken it's really hard for them to get that back and they have major regrets here why is this lover's card here but yet you're being called back together with this person knight of cups they may end up love bombing you which is also not really a great indicator of health a healthy connection but they feel you are distant from them, two of wands. They want this distance to not be the way it is any longer. Wheel of Fortune. You have some kind of a choice to make here, Libra, about whether or not you want to deal with this person's dishonesty or whether you're going to take them back. They do feel very strong, passionate love for you. You feel that connection as well. It's hard to deny the connection that you both share. They want to mend this relationship. They want to work on this relationship with you. They don't like being distant from you. They don't like that they created this monster, if you will, between the two of you. They, th they took things way too far. So you may have felt insecure in this relationship. Well, there's a reason for that because this person had a, has a tendency to be dishonest. They're really being called to the carpet here at this time. What's the outcome in this situation here for Libra Spirit? The sun. I feel like if this person has learned their lesson, and I feel like they have, there's an opportunity for happiness between the two of you as you come back together, healing this connection. This person doesn't want it any other way than to come back with, together with you. They don't want to lose you here. Queen of Wands. But this whole situation has made you much more independent here with this Queen of Wands. This situation, um, never again are you going to be hurt by this person. Never again do you want to be in, trapped with, with this codependency here. Was the toxic energy between the two of you? I think you've realized something here that Libra, that your person is going to do whatever they want to do, whether you try and tell them what they should and shouldn't do or not. They're going to do what they want. This is a difficult one to resolve or reconcile here. This is something that you're going to have to sit with and decide what you want. Either way, happiness is yours here with the sun card. I feel like a lot of you here are not going to take this person back. The queen of wands is someone who's independent, who doesn't put up with anything they're confident. They don't need anyone. And I feel like that's what this relationship has really done. It's brought you into this place of not needing anyone ever again. Because this was a, such a profound connection between the two of you, this soulmate relationship was very difficult to come to terms with when this person cheated or went behind your back and betrayed this relationship because there was a strong connection here. So I do feel like Libra I'm picking up to it. This person was like, you know, if we can't be in a relationship together, maybe we can just be friends with benefits. You're wondering if that's even what you want either. I don't know that you really want that. I feel like you want 
to be with someone who's honest with you. You don't want to keep repeating cycles with this person because I do feel like once the door is open for them to keep recommitting this act of, well, Libra took me back, so that means I can kind of get away with whatever I want here. I don't feel like you want that. I feel like your happiness is with yourself regard regardless of what your choice is here in this situation. All right, guys, if that resonated for you all, please hit the like button and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.